everyone, Kerry here, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing great today. So this is not a speed build, this is actually a shell challenge that I have prepared for you guys because I wanted to give away a copy of the new Pronormal Stuff pack. So what better way to give away a copy of a pack than doing a shell challenge? <laughs> so here's the shell that I created. This is actually kind of small, I can say, but it has a little twist on it because it actually has a basement. So you can turn this weird shell that has three floors into something interesting. Um, but following the simple rules of a shell challenge, I'm gonna show you the rules right here on the screen so you can see them. And also the rules are in the description of the video and they will be also in the description of the shell when you want to download them from the gallery. So. First of all, you cannot change any of the existing walls. You cannot add more walls on the outside. You can only add walls on the inside. So if you want to do this, this is not allowed. If you want to add a new room, you cannot do it. But you can actually add walls here on the interior of the build. So if you want to close this section like that, you can definitely do that. So only you can add only walls on the inside of the build, you cannot change any of the structure on the outside. But you can also add interior walls, you can add foundation, platforms, roofs, fences, half walls, whatever you wanna add, you can do that. But you cannot change the existing shape of this shell. You cannot modify that. You can add all of the other things that I mentioned. You can use all the packs, so all packs are allowed for this challenge. Um, no CC and no mods, and by no mods I mean not even the tool mod, please. Do not use any mods for this build, so it's a fair challenge for all of us. Um, you can place this shell in any lot and in any size in any world that you want, that's completely up to you. And the due date for this is January the 28th, so that's the last day that you can actually actually upload your entry to the gallery um on the 29th yeah, yeah you cannot do that it's not going to be acceptable for the challenge so yeah january the 28th is the last day for you to upload this shell to the gallery also you have to upload this shell under the hashtags carry sims and carry shell 2 both of the hashtags have to be in the description of your entry. Otherwise, um, you're not going to be qualified to participate. And also, I'm going to be streaming all of the entries uh, that participate on January the, the 30th on my Twitch channel. That's twitch.tv slash Sims if you want to follow me there. And I'm going to be making a video that it's going to um, be uploaded to YouTube with the top five entries including the winner. So the winner is going to be announced on that video during the stream. I'm not gonna say who the winner is. I'm just gonna show you the builds, but uh, the winner is going to be announced when I upload the video with the top five entries. So remember, um, those are only the, the instructions for the challenge. Um, I've seen a lot of crazy stuff. Of course, you can rotate this uh, this lot. You can rotate the shell. You can put it on a cliff. You can put it under water. You can, I don't know, have this floor on the ground floor and the other two on top. You can do that. Um, but remember that you cannot change the shape of the shell. Okay, that's all. Um, that's the most important instruction of all that's something that's really important that you guys follow you cannot modify what i already have um basically that's all i have to say i hope you guys participate and remember that the winner is going to receive a copy of the new paranormal stuff pack oh and also it's not necessary that this is turns into a spooky paranormal build it's not necessary that you do that you can turn it into a residential or community lot that's completely up to you um a rental whatever you want to do with that but it's not necessary that you turn it into something spooky or paranormal okay that's not gonna be um 
a condition for you to participate or it's not going to give you more credit <laughs> um, when I choose the winner. So yeah, I hope you guys participate. I hope you guys like this idea. I know you have like 10 days to do this, but it was a quick show. So I hope you guys participate and you enjoy it. And that's all I have to say today. So I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.